Five times world champion Brazil will look to add one more silverware at the upcoming FIFA World Cup at Qatar, which starts from the 20th of November. Brazil has been always a watch-out team in the World Cup since its inception in 1930. Brazil is in the Group G with the other teams like Serbia, Switzerland and Cameroon and they will play their first match on the 25th of November against Serbia at the Lucille Iconic Stadium. It can be predicted that it will not be a difficult task for Brazil to top the group with the superstars having in their team with the likes of Neymar, Casemiro, Vinícius Júnior, Thiago Silva, Fabinho and others. Brazil won the World Cup in 1958, 1962, 1970, 1994 and 2002. But since 2002, Brazil didn't reach beyond the semi-finals. In the last World Cup in Russia, Brazil lost against Belgium 1-2 in the quarterfinals. In the 2014 World Cup at home, Brazil were humiliated against Germany by 1-7 in the semi-finals. But now many footballing pundits believe that the current Brazilian team can do something and they can taste World Cup victory again. So can they improve upon that form this time around? Can they go all the way in Qatar and land the record 6th title? Looking back at the last two successes, the team in 1994 featured the likes of Mazzinho, Mauro Silva, Dunga, Zinho, Bebeto and Romario, while the 2002 team contained the likes of Cafu, Mauro Silva, Cleberson, Roberto Carlos, Rivaldo, Ronaldinho, Kaká and Ronaldo, averaging 2.57 goals per game. For the last few years, after the Ronaldo, Ronaldinho, Kaká, Rivaldo generation, Brazil has been surrounded with the one footballing name that is Neymar and he has been the household name since winning the FIFA Confederations Cup in 2013. Everyone loves watching Brazil play at the World Cup and this also means their fans want Neymar to showcase the magic. The good thing in this Brazilian team is that besides Neymar there are lots of many players who are already superstars in the football world. Vinícius Júnior who is already the heart of Real Madrid's attack. Manchester United duo Casemiro and Fred are solid options in the holding role but Fabinho will fancy his chances as well. Philip Coutinho and Bruno Guimarães are also hoping to make the cut. There is no doubt Casemiro is one of the best defensive midfielders of his generation and having him in the team is the cherry on top for any coach in the world. Thiago Silva will be the mainstay in the defense and with the likes of Marquinhos, Danilo, Alexandro, Gabriel Magalhães, Eda Militao makes them one of the strongest defense line in the tournament. Silva will be a very crucial part in Brazil's back four and his partnership with Marquinhos at the back may be key to Brazil's chances of World Cup victory.